It's fish boil time! It's Connor! Hey guys! So we're at Connor's family's house in northern Michigan, right on the lake. It's beautiful. And what else are we up to here? We're having a fish boil. A fish boil is essentially what it sounds like, right? You boil fish, but there's so much more that goes into it. Yeah, it's a whole production. It involves everything from freshly hand-picked vegetables to diesel fuel. Mm-hmm, right, we've got the whole spectrum here. <laughs> a fish boil is kind of the perfect summer thing. All right, so here's how you do it. First things first, make a fire. Then get a big old pot. Is it heavy? <laughs> and fill it to the top with water. Put the pot over the fire until it comes to a boil. While you're waiting for that to happen, you can start prepping the food. So you need three to four pounds of small red potatoes. So I've been told that the reason that you take off just like a quarter size piece from the potato is so that the salt can enter in and give it all the flavor. And then you want about eight ears of corn and then the fish. And you want about three to four pounds of fish. We like white fish. If you're ever in Michigan, get white fish. Once the water comes up to a boil, put a bunch of salt in it. Then put in the potatoes. About 10 minutes later, put in the corn. Followed shortly thereafter by adding the fish. Fish boil. So the potatoes are in for a total of 20 minutes. The corn is in for a total of 10 minutes and the fish is in for a total of eight minutes. Then the very last step, this is the fun part. The boil over. Stand back. So the idea is all the fish oils and stuff you might not want to eat floats to the top of the water. And if you throw a bunch of diesel fuel on the flames, you get this huge explosion and it all boils over and gets all the garbage off. And then you just got this really great cooked food to eat. And basically your entire meal has been cooked right there in the pot. There's a couple traditional things that you gotta have with your fish boil. Right, rye bread and coleslaw. And of course, butter and lemon drown everything in butter and lemon. Yeah, can't go wrong with that. And shout outs to mom for putting together the whole spread. Dad can make a fire, but mom, mom brings the meal together. It was really beautiful. It was really an unforgettable meal. It was awesome. Nice job, dad. Fish boil success. Heck yeah. And don't forget guys. Keep it quirky. Also, this goes without saying, this is a fire, be careful. Always be careful when you're using diesel or any kind of accelerant. Don't use gasoline. You won't like the results. And if you need an adult, just, just get one. Be smart. <laughs>